On a dark, stormy night, a flash of strange lightning suddenly appeared in the Count's mysterious castle and revived a ghost bride. However, contrary to the happy mood of the bride, the boy was terrified and tried to run away from her. What were the reason behind the scene and all the strange things going on here? Let's find out with World of Fairy Tales. In a beautiful town, there lived a boy and a girl who fell in love with each other named Victor and Victoria. <laughs> they had the same passion for playing the piano. <laughs> Unlike Victoria's rich background, Victor's family was very poor, so Victoria's family always forbade them. However, Victoria's family loved their daughter very much, and seeing Victor truly love Victoria, they finally decided to give him a chance. Victor, a wanderer like you must have heard of Rings of Light, right? Yes, it's a pair of love rings that whoever owns it will receive God's good wishes in the wedding ceremony for a happy and eternal love. <laughs> That's right, so if you bring that pair of rings back to Victoria, we'll agree to your marriage. But William is a hot-tempered and overbearing wizard! There were many people who came to his castle to ask to buy it, but they were all rejected and even injured! But even so, I will still try to bring the rings back to us. Trust me! After convincing Victoria, Victor set out and reached the castle of the wizard William. However, like so many others, no matter how Victor offered anything to get the rings, William refused. In this life, I have everything. No one or anything can exchange these rings. You had better go back. Well, if he continues like hmm. this, I won't be able to get the rings. Hmm. I have to find other ways. Oh yes, hmm. William is a hot-tempered, easily excitable person. If so, then... William! Didn't you just say that no one can take the rings from you? But if I get them, please give them to me. Huh, why should I accept the challenge of a brat like you? Do you disagree or dare not agree? Is it possible because you fear losing to a normal person like me? That's insanity! <laughs> <laughs> okay, I agree. Let's see what you can do. And if you lose, I will make you my servant. Okay! <laughs> At the first spell, Victor was unable to match the magic of the wizard William. However, Victor did not give up easily. He used the surrounding things to defeat the wizard William. And successfully obtained the ring. <laughs> Witnessing Victor's intelligence, the wizard William was not only not angry, but he also was very pleased. As a mighty wizard, I mm -hmm. cannot break a promise, but this is our only love memento, so please cherish it. Thank you. <laughs> you are welcome. Your fiancé is very lucky. She has a husband who is both brave and intelligent. Do you mind if I ask who she is? Of course not. She is the girl I love the most in this world. She is not only beautiful, but also kind and good at playing the piano. With this ring, I will propose to her. However, 
Victor did not expect that the act of accidentally placing the ring on the hand-shaped flower statue caused the whole castle to shake and lightning appeared everywhere. While Victor did not understand what was happening, a hand grabbed him. <laughs> My fiancé, you have come at last. No, I'm not you. You don't need to be embarrassing. I personally heard you say you will propose to my daughter, Emily. Therefore, the body and soul of my beloved Emily is about to be revived. Turned out the wizard William and his wife once had a daughter named Emily. He loved and pampered his daughter very much. <laughs> However, Emily, like her mother, was short-lived, so she soon left him. Uh. William, however, used magic to retain Emily's soul and found a way to revive his daughter by a true, sincere, and voluntary love. Unluckily, no one accepted to love Emily, so the wizard <gasps> William gradually gave up hope until today. When Victor accidentally said the proposal, to the flower statue and awaken Emily's soul inside it. So you are her father and she... she's a zombie? My daughter is married to you. Your true love will make her human. Wedding ceremony with your daughter? But the one I want to marry isn't your daughter. It's Victoria of Everglot family. But didn't you just wear a ring and ask to marry my daughter? Just now, I didn't know that statue had your daughter in it, so I put this ring on her finger. But the one I love is only Victoria, so... I don't care if you do it on purpose, but if you don't agree to marry Emily, you won't be able to escape this castle, forever. Sorry to misunderstand, but I can't agree to your condition. Then you should take the punishment. Father! As soon as he finished saying, the wizard William cast spells and captured Victor in his castle. Day by day, Victor did everything he could, but he still could not escape. You are tired today. Let's eat some- Stay away from me! I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. Alright, I understand. My father locked you up here and forced you to marry an ugly person like me. So you must feel angry. But please eat something, or else I, oh, and your loved ones will be very sad if they know your situation now. Emily, I'm sorry for my rudeness. In fact, I also found you to be very nice to me. Even though I accidentally hurt you, instead of raising your voice, you still treated me with kindness. <sighs> However, it's not because you are not beautiful or you're a zombie that I refuse to marry, but because I have only one lover, Victoria. So please understand me. After that, Victor told Emily all about Victoria, about the reason why he went to this castle. <sighs> I see. In fact, my father only wanted me to be human again, so he acted hastily and misunderstood what you meant to me. If the person you really love isn't me, I can't force you to love me either. In order to atone for my father, I will try to help you escape the castle and find Victoria. Are you okay? I'm fine. Maybe it's been a long time since I've used magic that my body can't adapt. Let's keep going. Emily took the opportunity that her father was still asleep and helped Victor escape the castle. However, they didn't notice that there was a gaze that was constantly following them. When he got back to Victoria's house, Victor found Victoria getting intimate with another guy. Victor panicked and shocked. He couldn't believe everything was happening, so he rushed to ask Victoria. I haven't even asked you where you have been missing for the past few days, or you might hang out with some strange girls. And now, you are already yelling at me. Besides, the person just now was my fiancé, introduced by my parents. He is both handsome and rich, so I decided to cancel the marriage with a poor and rude person like you. 
You should go back to your home. <gasps> Wait! <gasps> Why are your nails so long? You usually play the piano, so your fingernails are always neatly trimmed. I... I... You aren't Victoria. After all, who are you? I'm the one you're trying to escape. With that, Victor and Emily were brought back to the castle by the wizard William. <gasps> Turned out that he knew about Victor and Emily's escape, so he tracked down and disguised as Victoria to extinguish Victor's last hope of love, but unexpectedly was discovered. <laughs> However, the wizard William still had the last way, the real Victoria he kidnapped before to force Victor to marry Emily. Be obedient and get married to my daughter. If you come over here, I will immediately take her life. Hmm? Father, please don't do that. The one Victor loves is not me, but Victoria. No, Emily. I just want the best for you. Look at you yourself. Because of him, you used <gasps> magic so much that your body was injured like that. But he doesn't care about you. I'm voluntary, not... Don't say more. I've already decided. If Victor won't marry you, I'll show him what it feels like to lose a loved one. Okay, to save Victoria, I'll agree to anything. But I can't agree to marry you! Mm. Because she didn't want Victor to be in a predicament, Emily used her remaining magic to prevent her father from harming anyone further. However, the more Emily used magic, the weaker her body became. When she saved Victoria, Emily <laughs> gradually disappeared. <gasps> Emily, why would you save them and sacrifice yourself like that? I... I will make Victor marry you immediately so that you can be revived. <sighs> No, father. I know you love me very much, and I have a crush on Victor, but Victor loves Victoria. So, even if Victor agrees to marry me and help me revive, he will never truly love me. If so, my life will be lived in pain and regret. I beg you to set them free. But what about me? I can't let you leave me like your mother. Mother and I have never left you. We'll always be in your heart. That's right. I get it. Despite grief, Wizard <laughs> William eventually regained his magic and accepted <laughs> to let go of his daughter. <clears throat> Therefore, I ask you to bless them and let my soul rest in joy and happiness. <gasps> Victor and Victoria were also very sorry for Emily. Suddenly, a light shone and brought healthy Emily back to life. <laughs> it turned out, thanks to paternal love, friendship, as well as self-sacrifice, helped Emily to be revived. <laughs> Victor, even though I can't be with you, I still hope you and Victoria live happily ever after. I also hope that a kind and understanding mm. person like our Miss Emily will soon find your own soulmate. <laughs> 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 And then with the help of wizards William and Emily, Victor and Victoria's wedding was finally held with everyone's blessings. <laughs> Emily was also very happy to see her friends happy and wished that a good love life would come to her.